What's up guys, on this let's play, we're going to be playing Until Dawn. Whoa my fuck man, fuck off. Alright, let's try again. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. I'm going to have to turn the sound down, because I just had a mini heart attack. Oh my fucking god man. Is this what it's going to be like? This whole game? I'm not. I'm not okay with that. Oh my god! All right, let's read all this shit. I'll put me up top corner up here. Butterfly effect. I've heard and read about this shit. Uh, things that I say change the game, even the smallest decision. Like, oh god, I hope it doesn't have kids in this game. I don't like kids, they scare me. How many possibilities though? Maybe it's a line, there's only two light paths. Maybe even one path. Oh god, because it's in a random... Wait, is it a big house or is it like a random cottage in the middle of fucking nowhere? And hide and seek. Why? Mike. What can do with a knife outside? Mike. Oh, Mikey, Mikey, Mikey. Hannah. Hey, Hannah. Tutorial. Use a right stick to look around. Objects say glint. Okay. Press and hold RT to pick up the bottle. Why why would I need to pick up this bottle? This is a smash it around some pedophile rapist guy's head. Who's whispering in my ears? Okay. Oh okay, we're not whispering the snowing, my bad. Jeez, God, God, I need to stop being so jumpy. Brother, you've outdone us all. Ooh, I should have gone for a wee before I start this. Well, I'm not going towards the door. Fuck that, there's a dude of a machete outside. La 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 la, this isn't too bad. Oh, what are you doing, ho?
guess I'm gonna go up and see other people. Oh, oh, what's that? Oh, oh. What's that? Lock. Do I wanna go upstairs? Fine. What am I supposed to be doing right now? Isn't I have to look out a window? Somewhere out there, all right. I don't even know what what's the aim of this game. What do I do just to like get the shit out of myself? Don't wait, those men up. Cozy by the fire. See if something here is a knife. I need to protect myself. It's dirty fucking parts. Should have done them. That's that's not me being sexist. I meant in general. They should have all chipped in. <laughs> oh here we go. Press an old RT to pick up the note. Anna, you look so damn hot in that shirt. But I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest. I guess that's room at 2 a.m. Mike. Oh my god. What did our Her. sister get herself into now? Uh, oh, was that it? Got your nice nice Supposed to be able to do with a knife outside, creepy little Mike. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Who even says that? Don't do it. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt? What are you doing? Oh, here? you bullies. Oh. Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, it's all gonna be just a stupid prank. Uh. Oh, man. You guys are jerks. You know that? Oh shit. Wait, Josh. Obviously. Josh. Josh. Fuck. Guys, there's someone outside. What the hell? Hannah! Oh, for What's going on? Say. Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Oh, oh shit. shit. Oh, my God. Where? Where are you going? Uh, safe. Always be safe. I want to. Damn it. She would have gone to safe route. We haven't lost time. That's what my thinking was. Oh, the footsteps. I'm on the right path. Well, there's footsteps that way. I'm obviously gonna follow the friggin' footsteps. Oh god, it could be the guy with a knife though. Nice, moose. Ow, wherever you are, dear. Beam using the right stick. Oh, that's quite cool. They put it up in the sky, you jackass. Oh, she's gonna be dead. She's gonna be dead. She's gonna be dead. Mm. 
Yes, walk faster. Hold her on to walk faster. Fucking run. Gallop. That was that was like a little girl's screen. That wasn't a fucking Hello? deer. Hello? Oh god, what's that? Fucking was that? We just what? Play. Fuck that. Oh my god. This game, man. Why are we playing this? <clears throat> okay, uh, try both eyes. I swear I just saw Hannah die on that. That was weird and messed up, and I didn't like it. Mistress man. I haven't got any clues about the mistress man. I got a totem pole. Ain't got a butterfly either. Oh god. This looks like a dead body. Probably just some rocks. Yeah, it's rocks. Walk faster, walk faster, walk faster. Camera angle, bro. Put me closer to her. I don't want to see a fucking bush. Oh my god. Why is the fire? Hannah. Hannah. Oh, thank God, Hannah. Hannah. But you're dead. Hannah. Come off like that. It's only a joke. Oh, no, I want to see your boobs. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. So dumb. On contract. Take his hand, obviously. Let go, drop Hannah. Well, let go of that. I ain't gonna grab his hand. <laughs> At the end of the day, right? I wasn't gonna let my sister's hand go. Now we've got two dead bitches already. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right, we will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up cards? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It is essential. 
to answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Yeah, clear on a farm. Definitely uneven, uneven, uneasy. Okay, honesty is good. It's getting close, bro. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? Scarecrow? Yeah, Fucking corn, is it? Well, I see. I see. Let's say the scarecrow were not there. Would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Say a week. For example, no. Who would want her to stay on a farm in the middle of nowhere on her own? No. Why not? Lonely, man. I see. There's a fine line between the peacefulness of solitude and the loneliness of isolation. Perhaps this is something we can explore in the future. Hmm? Because I'm afraid we're out of time. Need some fucking lip so, fillers or something, bro. Until the next session. And uh, until then, try to surround yourself with friends in a place that make you feel safe. He's creepy. He makes me feel more uneasy. That scarecrow. Here we go. Complete the game. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. <laughs>
us going back after what happened last year. But I just want you all to know um, it means it means so much to me. Your fucking fault, Mike. And that uh, you do that stupid prank, should we still be alive? I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's Wait, is that Mike? party like we're fucking porn stars, Mike. okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! <laughs> Back it. I don't think that dude was bad. He was like just burning shit in the woods. I think he tried to help. Blackwood Pines. Suddenly, the dude with a machete there straight away. Ah, ah, ah. Taking photos. Ventures consider Hannah's best friend who wasn't there for her when she died. Sweet. Hello? Someone there? Yeah, there's someone there. Make me, why are you making me walk this, man? It's obviously gonna scare the shit out of me, so I'm just gonna jump out. Fuck you, bird. Uh, 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 uh. Not a place like home, there's no place like home. That bird's gonna fly off. Thank you. Gates busted. Climb over? Chris? Oh, what? Fuck you. Ask a lady to climb over. It, why is it making me check? It's not a practical oh, joke. Jesus, never mind. Oh, there's a wall over here. I'm guessing that is a big wall for her to climb. That is a big wall. Oh, I suppose it's in groove. Let's go safe. Always go safe, kids. Whoa! That was nearly not safe. Whoa! That was dangerous. Uh, climb. I'm jumping. Me and my jump. Whoa! -ho 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 -ho. That's gonna be the one. Get that foot in that groove, girl. Got your border boots. She's adventurous, but she's smart. Look at that warm hat. What the skirt's all about, but you can forget. Oh god, there's a guy having a wank in the bush. Go away, you creep. Why is he out of breath? He's rather having a talk. Or I'm thinking it's that guy with a like flame torch before. Flame torch? Who says flame torch? Flamethrower. Stop rabies. Huh? Oh god. I can't move. <laughs> Do that? Why well, I can't I can't move? I ought to shoot it away, I'm not gonna lie. Wait, if you're unsure what to do next, you can see your current objective by pressing R1. Come on. Why is that guy just following us? Oh pedophile dude. Just 
probably like some other person that's meeting us and that turned out to be all a good fun laugh. Oh, what's this? <laughs> cool. cool, a little native. Death, black butterflies. Death, danger, red butterflies. Lost brown butterflies. Gardens yellow. Fortune white. Is that hinting at something? Like collectibles, maybe? You'll see them in the world. Oh, shit. As you explore, you can discover totem artifacts. <clears throat> Picking a totem up, return it will reveal a color butterfly. Okay. That's what the butterflies mean. Not in the bag, are you? Hello, what do we have here? Maybe I should have brought an archivist out. Chris? Sam, hey, you made it. Oh, from Ashley, detective humor. Humorous, we'll see about that. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. It's going to blow your mind. My mind? It's going to blow my mind. Well, there's someone hanging there, that's a stack, right? Bag or something. Ta da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to what mind. Beauties? Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of the ski lodge? Ah, uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Uh, no, you go ahead. Oh god. Alright. Yeah, that's something shooting or something, you piece of shit. Oh, am I controlling it? The right stick to aim, press RT to shoot, okay. Oh shit, I gotta shoot that. I thought I could pick whatever I wanted. That's quite easy. Bang, bang, bang. John Wayne. Pressing the lady. Wow, nice shooting tits. All right, I'm bad. I'm a bad. doing that. I'm going to go ahead and get what this wild case of beginner's luck. No, I don't think so, girl. Who talks like that? Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Don't you dare shoot that squirrel. She just pet that squirrel on the way up here. She would not like it. <laughs> nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. Sacked. <sighs> I think this is funny. That's why he's single. Give that ugly bird. Got a squirrel, douchebag. Oh, now I'm him. Now I'm Chris the douchebag. Great. Oh, and he's cold. Who found? Wanted. A 
yeah, it can't be 1999 now, can it? You think we'll get a visit from America's most wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh, come Is it 1999? Can't be. Yeah, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I'm guessing you got a Chris, huh? I, I don't know. They said they found people Chris. sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Creepy man that's following you. After you. Oh, real gentleman. Oh, at least he's locked behind us, so that creepy man can't get in. It's feel a bit safer. Oh god, there's a TV over there. Oh, I'm gonna have to go towards the creepy TV. What's this? I think. I thought the car was yeah. closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm trying to get the appeal of getting time at the shooting range. How long? Backwood Pines Hotel, Sanatorium, for a healthy body and mind. Oof. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. I'm not so rich. I don't need to fall out of mountains. CTV of the actual like outside where we just were. Quite creepy. I thought someone was gonna be like on it then. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but. Why is right? He's funny, funny guy. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. Oh, this was weird. That's all automatic, and I was controlling it. You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, you know, kind of been worried. No, no, it was it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. Yeah, he was a dude that was asleep on the uh, you know what? The let's side. Just, let's just stop. And I tried to now. wake up. Another trip. Ah, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed, but the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him, so the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So, I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact Gene Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra. I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone right now, or or talking to some other person entirely. Boom! Butterfly effect. He said it. Butterfly effect. New girlfriend, Mike the douchebag. I like Mike. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Oh, oh my God. God. Hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please. Oh my god. I thought we were gone. 
Connors. Another ten minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, thanks, Chris. Look, you got a lot of meat on my bones. This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M. Slit were together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. Classy bird. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget it's good to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Hello! That's Mike's ex. Something's gonna kick off here. Can't have an ex and a new girlfriend. Hey, Mike. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. There's Mike the tooth bag. Oh, that's no, Matt. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Sorry, sorry, Matt. Oh, and he's carrying all the luggage. Of course he is. Sleep mule. At the mule. <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's going to be weird seeing everyone up here again. I find it weird. Like, surely everyone would meet at the bottom of the mountain and then go up together. That's what you're doing in real life. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> I told you Mike was a douchebag. Dickhead Mike. Intelligent, I beg to differ. We have been persuaded. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends. Not anymore. Right? Yeah. No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods. <sighs> Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. All friends here. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hate you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, Guilty! I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trail. Right. See you, man. See ya. Right. See ya. Bye, ya. Bye, Mac. <gasps> Great guy. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah. All the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. I just really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. He wants to go. I'm not leaving you alone. Em, I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why yeah, do you have to cool question woman. everything there we I say? I'm, I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Bruh. Yeah. Okay. Where's the option Fine. to hit her? You want. I'm joking. Thank you shouldn't, you. <laughs> you shouldn't use violence or hit women. Even if they're stupid. Stupid 
woman. He's obviously going down to see her ex. I'm not stupid. Me and Matt aren't stupid. We know what's going on. Where the fucking hell is this? I like a fucking turtle thing, man. Ashley! She has a crush on Chris. Oh, fuck me. Everyone fancies everyone here, man. It's like a love triangle. Love hexagon. Oh god, where are we looking? What are we gonna see? What are we gonna see? Oh, that's that girl who's waiting for her boyfriend. I think. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Or not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big Yeah, probably. I think I'd see Sam, you lying bitch. Oh, Fucking God. asshole. Oh, hey, now he's being a dick. Scare you. Game. But not like for real. Scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Hey, well. Man, I'm I'm really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh it... let me check it out. Tell him. Sure. Tell him. Definitely. Definitely tell him. Um sure, uh go ahead. I'm not, go I'm, gonna be, I'm, I'm not a shit stirrer, but you know, you need to see. Look about shit. Son of a bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing you think? Well, yeah. It's I didn't ever kiss. It's not cheating. Ever? I don't know. I... Damn it. But it is a bit weird. Matt. I wouldn't like it. I wouldn't storm off down there causing a fight. All kicking off. Maybe I shouldn't have shit stuck. Now we're back with Jessica. Who's she waiting for? That phone. Don't read books. <laughs> oh, you did not just do that. Put your hand where I can see her. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Grab the stable. I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> you absolute shock. <laughs> Great. Hey, you know that? <laughs> It was just about check. Remember that? Oh shit! Oh, he has got good accuracy. Whoa, dodge that! Yeah, man. Two shots hit. What's that bird there? Hello, come on. Hey, Mike. Me, I'm an FPS player. You're not escaping me. You're not escaping these hands, bro. Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. You can't hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. I don't want to hit the bird, bro. Now you hit him in the head. Boom! Whoa! Oh. Right. And then what? Oh, no more. Oh, oh yeah. Oh more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right. All right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? You're a worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. I am the Snowball Queen. That is my name. Oh shit! Grab a snowball, girl. Ah! Go kiss that son of a bitch. Uh -huh. When I sit here drinking okay. my water, he's trying to kiss me. Really trying to kiss my ass. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. 
but you'll have to wait more later. Yeah, but we should get even again, unless it's yeah. a crow. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. Yeah. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Dirty bitch. Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Here. Oh god, who's that? So I'll actually cut to you again. It won't quit. I Talking trust that ass. you have stayed in the company of good friends since our last session. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Ooh, okay. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Um, the women, the moan a lot. I don't know. Oh wait, I'm supposed to go that way. Plain. Big crowds of people I don't like. I think planes are quite like sick, man. Like flying above, breaking the possibility of flying in a little metal machine. I think you feel free up there, so I feel anxious when I'm around people. So let's go with that. I fear drowning. I fear heights. Definitely heights. I'm a powerful swimmer. I don't think I'll ever drown unless someone grab me. Um, I, it's not a rare bear, man. I could slip, especially if I'm drunk. Snakes or rats? Definitely rats, because they stink, man. Even though I've got a hamster, it's pretty much a rat. Snakes are cool. Spoons are scary, knives are scary. Uh, I know man, I've never really, I, I've got guns and I've got knives, but I feel like I've been friends with a knife and I've never been friends with a gun, so I'll probably pick a knife, sure, I haven't experienced a gun. Rat scare me or cockroaches? Definitely cockroaches, because they're just weird and they just don't die. <laughs> like these rats like look like animals you know see them looking at you I don't see a cockroach look at you oh, okay now it's getting creepy scarecrows are creepy as hell but they're like not real they're just hay and human clothes to scare the crows clowns are human and they've been mass murdered so I'm gonna go with clowns. For sure. Gore? What even is that? I just get heard. Bows are scary. Gore. This is a hard one because I'm not really scared of birds. Gore doesn't scare me at all, man, like blood and everything. Look at birds like flapping around and stuff and they're flapping all over your head. Oh my god, why do that, man? See, that startled you. So sorry. <sighs> You're doing very well. Yeah, I was. Jump in love. Why would you just bash down on the desk for? Asshole. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instinct, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Okay, so I've got a time limit. Spider, definitely spiders. That is creepy how they move, man. Bird 
spiders or needles. I've got a lot of toes, so birds. Turn the page. Some, again, clowns are real and zombies aren't, so I love like Walking Dead and that, so clowns, sure. Wolves. Well, it's, it's a wolf, I don't know why I said dogs. I love dogs. Dark. Uh, birds again. Can bash down on the desk? No. Dogs don't scare me. They're unpredictable, which is scary, but. I have to go with birds all the time. It's gonna think I've got like a phobia of fucking birds. I don't even mind birds. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so. Because I picked that, I bet the game gonna put loads of birds in. You watch. And I'm not even scared of birds. Clowns and crows. <laughs> the sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. Well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we can talk again very soon. I'm guessing whoever the character survives, that's us. Or is it just talking to us as if... <laughs>